Big time rant today from the Bud Man about this brutal beating on a Central Florida school bus. Happened back in July over in Gulfport in Pinellas County. Video has just come to light now. And the mainstream media is intentionally, intentionally missing the main point on this story. What we have is three black kids about 15 years old mercilessly pummeling a 13-year-old white kid on a school bus while the black school bus driver calls 911 but doesn't intervene because he thinks the situation is too explosive and too dangerous. The kid gets a broken arm, gets all beat up, somehow scurries out of the bus. Apparently he refused to buy drugs from these kids and they decided that he was going to pay the price for that. But the point is, everyone in the mainstream media, including Fox, is focusing on whether or not the school bus driver uh, did enough. He is not required in Pinellas County to intervene in a situation he considers to be uh, dangerous to himself. That's really not the story. The story is this, and they're not reporting it in the mainstream media. It is this. The three attackers were black. The victim was white. I want you to think for a moment what kind of coverage the mainstream media would have given this debacle over in Pinellas County on that school bus if the races of the key players had been reversed. Three white kids beating up on a black kid in a school bus. It would have been considered a hate crime racially driven of the first magnitude. It would have triggered Jesse Jackson, Al Sharpton, and the rest of the race baiters, and we would have had right here in Central Florida, once again, what would amount to the sequel to Trayvon Martin and all the hysteria that has surrounded that. Justice is supposed to be blind, but it is not in this country, and the mainstream media proves it with their unwillingness to focus on the race aspect of the school bus beating in Pinellas County. That's what I think. What do you think? Join me for the next edition of Bud Hedinger Live right here on FM 104.5 AM 540 WFLA. I will look for you then.